Guys, what is up? Welcome to another episode of Maximilian Must Know. This is going to be a sort of quick take on three new fragrances that uh, Scent Story has put out, all from their 24 collection. Uh, you guys might remember years back at this point, I did an original Scent Safari on those first 24 fragrances that came out, gold, platinum, dark, etc. Uh, and I, I really still love those and wear them and enjoy them. You know, smelled some of the stuff that came out uh, since then. I like the Oud edition. And then, you know, I got in touch with Sense Story a while back and they let me check out Ice, which came out um, a little bit ago. And I like that one as well. And so they came out with some new stuff, some more from the Elixir collection. And they sent me samples of them. Um, these are available on the Scent Story website. I will link to that in the description. And the prices on this is 100 ml for $115. They all are, are all Eau de Parfum. And they do have sample packs where you can really try all the 24 stuff for $30. So let's get into it. The first one is called 24 uh, Elixir Azure. Uh, and this one has notes of lavender, artemisia, orange blossom, amber, musk, and vanilla. Um, it's it's fine. You know, you might sort of think aquatic because of Azor, which is like a, a color that sometimes people associate with the ocean. Um, it's more sort of gentlemanly, one of those like gentlemanly scents. Don't think aquatic. Think almost like more like a little bit of a lavender scent with some spiciness into it. I wouldn't say it's like a mainstream designer scent, but it sort of veers um, in that direction. It's it's not really challenging. Um, I think if you're looking for something, you know, um, I think if you just want to smell pleasant, this this will get you there. Uh, I, I would like a little bit more to it. Uh, it also isn't a boomer on my skin as far as that goes, but it's it's definitely a pleasant sort of lavender, um, ambery fragrance. The next one is called Neroli. And Neroli has Neroli, notes of Neroli, tobacco, musk, and fig tree. This one for me was super light. Um, it's not one that I love, just because, you know, when I see Neroli in a fragrance, I'm hoping for a big Neroli note. You know, I think of, like, the classic Neroli fragrances I like, the, like, you know, the Eau de Colognes and Zerzhov stuff. And, and this is just a sort of light, citrusy fragrance. I definitely don't get any tobacco. I don't get any fig. I get sort of a light Neroli um, scent that just... Uh, that just really isn't something that uh, that sat on my skin in, in too great of a way. It's not bad. Again, none of these are going to make you smell bad. These are all going to make you make you smell nice. But for me, uh, Neroli and Azor, one hundred fifteen dollars for a hundred ml. Um, you know, I, I don't know. I probably probably not great choices for me. And then the last one is called Ambrosia. And Ambrosia has wild rose, white lily, cypress, jasmine, vanilla, violet, and green notes. Now for me, this is the best of the three without a doubt, but it does sort of smell like other 24 scents. Um, it's got that real ambery sweetness. I don't know that I smell rose um, or jasmine. I get kind of vanilla and amber. Um, not bad, but you know, it, again, if I'm being honest, and, and, and that's really why I'm here, you know, I, I prefer other uh, collections from Scent Story to this one. I just think these are either um, sort of either redundant or sort of already, there's already fragrance, m many fragrances that smell like this, and I really like when Scent Story sort of comes up with new stuff and is is bold and, and goes over the top and makes really um, interesting strong smelling fragrances and i think I, I get it i think here they're trying to do like a collection that's going to have some mass appeal and hopefully it will but for someone like me you know it's these aren't special fragrances they're as i said just either fragrances that i've sort of smelled before or i've smelled a million well yeah i've smelled a million times before so guys i would love to know uh, i th want to thank scent story uh for sending me these because i always love to check out what they put out and you know they've hit more times than, than they've missed for me um i'd love to know what other people think of this collection if they check them out um you know what's your favorite of the three do you think i'm totally off uh but uh you guys let me know and um uh that's it i will of course link to scent safari as i said that sample pack is a great deal uh 30 bucks for a bunch of their samples and um and i'll be back with more videos later this week guys thank you all so much for watching my name obviously is nice